Hey everyone, welcome back to the place we are testing every single mask and respirator on Amazon, including the weenie masks. <laughs> That's right. On Amazon though, they go as Ranto, so your mileage may vary. Let's open this box and get it in the clamper. Okay, that's weird packaging. It doesn't, I don't know why, but it makes me uncomfortable, that packaging. <laughs> so this is an FFP2, uh, which is like basically the European N95, I think. I actually don't know much about FFP2. But it, uh, I could tell that it's probably legit because it's got a lot of weird stuff on it I'm not used to seeing. And they're trying to sell it as a brand Ranto. Uh, but then part of the, part of the KN95 and uh, you know, the FFP2 standard, all of these standards and NIOSH N95, it's all the same. They, um, they make you put the manufacturer name on the actual mask so that you can actually know if you can trust the mask. This is a PFE machine, particulate filtration efficiency machine. It's the only reason y'all should be showing up to listen to me talk because uh, I don't know what I'm talking about, but this machine does. It does all the talking for me. Uh, Ranto 50 pack, bought this on Amazon. It's professional, don't worry, professional. Uh, this is basically the KN95 design with a head strap. So you've seen these before with N95s. Uh, but it has the head strap instead of the ear loose. They're saying headband. FFP2 is a European standard. Airflow resistance, uh, the breathability is 166, which is pretty high uh, for this CAN 95 style. Uh, our, we've seen usually, we like to see a below uh, 150 for that. Um, so I'm guessing that FFP2, but you can make a, you know, uh, something in the comments if I'm wrong. Um, is the N95 style, so I'm thinking that it should be hitting a 95% filtration. Uh, let's go ahead and test this. Oh, God, Lord. Oh. It's a something, and it's not good. It's like a broken light bulb is what it smells like. It's really weird. You know, I mean, you know, I wouldn't necessarily wish that smell on someone I didn't like very much, but whatever. Uh, headbands seem pretty good though. Some construction seems like a pretty solid. Why does that always happen? Why? Every time I go to compliment you mask, you disappoint me. I'm talking to masks now, so that's where we're at. And it's only like, you know, it's not even noon. That one's good. So it's the, oh, it's the bottom one that, that isn't super great. So does the weenie mask protect you? Let's see. Oh, 67.191, 67.191. And what's crazy about that really terrible uh, PFE is that um, the breathability wasn't good either. So you can't breathe in the mask, it smells like hot garbage and uh, and it doesn't protect you. There's definitely better masks that you could be buying out there, especially, well, 38 cents a unit though. That's pretty cheap for a, a, a respirator type mask. I wouldn't buy this one though. All right, thank you guys for watching. Thank you, Weenie, for making my day. Uh, and I will catch you guys on the next test.